racing away from that 1600 meter marker. Rocket Rumba is right there. Chapter and Verse with a good position goes off to lead them. Banzai Pipeline is at the rail. So smooth as amongst the leading group early on. On the outside is gone traveling. Raise a hallelujah is further back in the run. Then comes Don't Touch Me. Cape Falwind is along the inside in the yellow silks. Then comes Flying Vision. That's about eight or nine lengths off the leader with Coburn's Express. And Red Vision in the orange is the trailer. About 10 or 11 lengths off the leader. But on settling down and Luxembourg has now gone off to spearhead the attack. Back in second as Chapter and Verse perfectly plays. In third is So Smooth, then Banzai Pipeline. Razor Hallelujahs on the outside, then Rocket Rumba. Gone traveling, don't touch me. Cape Falwin's in the yellow near the rail. Then Flying Vision, Coburn's Express and Red Vision's the trailer. Bow to come into that home stretch now and Luxembourg will bring them in. Chapter and Verse comes towards the middle now to put in a claim. So Smooth is on the outside. Rocket Rumba between runners. Banzai Pipeline is on the inside. Then Gone Travelin. Chapter and Verse is the leader. Down the inside, Banzai Pipeline. So Smooth. Rocket Rumba. Gone Travelin's down the inside. Chapter and Verse, though, continues to run. Banzai Pipeline's trying to close it down. Gone Travelin's down the inside. Chapter and Verse clings to the lead over the last hundred, though. Anna chapter and verse looking for the line but will win banzai pipeline second gone traveling third and so smooth will get fourth number seven chapter and verse michael roberts the verse in jetterix i know michael liked this one i saw him before the first race nick johnson for marion thompson ambient stud and number seven at 250 the winner Second to number one, Banzai Pipeline. Gone traveling, number 10 will run into third. That pays up 690. And fourth to number four, so smooth. Toad favorite, the winner, number seven. As we look at this, and chapter and verse was always prominent. And the version Jetrix continues to cling away to the lead. Banzai Pipeline won't throw in the towel. And gone traveling is towards the left-hand side. That's the running of the second race until the third. Back to the studio. The result of the second race is 7, 1, 10 and 4. Favourite backers have got the meeting off to a great start. Two favourites to arrive and chapter and verse has got it one. And uh, with me is Michael Roberts. 100% strike rate for you today, Michael. Just the one runner, one winner. Congratulations. And uh, Nick's horse had a lot going for him today, didn't it? Yes, yeah, see, you know, um, the race at Marisburg, where I must be quite honest with you, I thought he'd win there. The race didn't plan out. It was nobody's fault. It just was a messy race. And, you know, he over-raced a little bit with Serena. And, uh, you know, unfortunately, it's difficult when horses over-race, over-trip, and still they can't kick on at the end. You know, they become one pace. Uh, but today it was quite an easy way. I said, you know, there was no orders really for Anton. I said, let them come and get you you know you got the experience first time on the poly for him w was uh, that a concern for you the first time on the poly no no because he's a uh, he's a light horse and he's you know and, he, and, and he's got a beautiful action so I mean you know those type of horses don't seem to uh, you know they go well on a poly actually to be honest with you you know the lighter framed horses with the nice actions and uh, so I mean I, they were talking about a lot of other horses in the race but I mean to me he, there was only the one horse chapter and verse he hit the line running, although he was looking for the line, yeah, but uh, he did his job, and, and he, he's lightly raced, he's versed in Jetrix, three-year-old, so he certainly, uh, maybe Nick could have some fun with this horse going forward. Yes, you know, he's not bred to be, uh, uh, he's actually bred to go much further than this, you know, we'll give him a nice break now, uh, he needs his vaccinations, and... Uh, and we'll see where he comes from because you know he's still very immature. You can see, you know, he you know he hasn't actually filled out into his frame yet. So uh, you know, there's a lot of improvement yet. Obviously, a big thank you to Nick Johnson. Thanks for your support, Nick. We appreciate it. And uh, to my stable staff, Ambient Stud who bred him. No, he's a, he's a nice horse. I think we're going to fund with him later on. Oh, well done, Michael. The, the stable's in a good space, and, and the horses are performing magnificently for you on the track. Well done. Yes, and also, Anton, nice ride. I, I appreciate it. Spot on. Lovely to talk to Michael Roberts. And just to let you know that the groom 
of chapter and verses, Luandile uh, Jojo, and uh, he's uh, been excused, and uh, make sure he gets the check. <laughs> Michael's going to certainly give uh, uh, his groom the check. He's just going to look after his horse, and that's the most important thing. The Michael Roberts stable are certainly in a good space. They're having winner after winner, and chapter and verse has added another to the tally. 7, 1, 10, and 4. Those are the results you're going to need. A good, aggressive ride from Anton Marcus. He's uh, steered this one home. We'll see you for race three in a short while.